Hey, this is Kelly Mills here up in Virginia. I'm at the Virginia Historical Society's Museum, and we're here for HardcoreNorfolk.com to cover the Virginia Rocks Rockabilly exhibit that's on display and traveling around the state, hopefully to come soon to a town near you. History. It's a, and it's, it's, it's a significant part of Virginia history, that, a story that hasn't been told. Um, it's, it's a particularly interesting story for a lot of reasons, one of which is there was a lot of change going on in Virginia and the United States in the 1950s after World War II, an enormous amount of change, uh, an enormous amount of uh, racial change, for example. There's a, there's a lot of blending of black and white music in this show. And so it, it, it appeals in lots of ways uh, and we've, we've um, reached new audiences who are, who are fascinated with this. And, and I'm sure your audience would be very interested. Oh, ab absolutely. And you need to hurry up and get up here fast because uh, well, it closes on December 12th. December 12th. Well, one of the uh, components of the show that I found most interesting uh, are, are, are the clips. We have um, video, two video monitors. Uh, one of them shows national figures, uh, and, and the other one shows s some of the local Virginia figures. Now, I was, I'm old enough to have, to have known uh, the major figures, the national figures, Little Richard, Jerry Lee Lewis, Elvis, of course. Um, but a lot of the uh, local Virginia ones I did not know about. And I think, um, I think you had to be old enough to go to some of the live performances. So this exhibition is very useful to a huge segment of the population just doesn't know about those figures. Um, so suddenly they all come alive in this show. And there were lots of them, and they were all throughout the state. Folks, that's about it. I've ordered a cherry coke and a burger and fries here at the Virginia Historical Society. And Paul Unger and I are signing off and getting ready to head back to good old Tidewell and Norfolk and Portsmouth. See you.